welcome back all. Let's jump into today's crypto, financial, and economic news. First story for the day. Coming from Cointelegraph. Litecoin transactions near an all-time high after gaining ground in consumer finance. So, as we learned from previous news, Litecoin is not only available through ATMs and acceptable via Visa and MasterCard, but also direct payment via BitPay and Verifone, point of sales. So this, in my opinion, has taken Litecoin to an all-time high. Congratulations, Litecoin. Now, into our second story. This is from Benzinga. This wallet just transferred $952 million worth of Bitcoin. So, this was obviously a whale moving a massive amount of Bitcoin, right? From one wallet to the next. Possibly, this could have been an over-the-counter sale or a trade. Who knows? But, it was a major crypto move with Bitcoin. Now on to our third story, also from Benzinga. And quote, Anonymous Bitcoin will just moved $117 million worth of Bitcoin off of Coinbase. End quote. This story is good news for Bitcoin holders. It means the big money makers are holding their Bitcoin because they moved it off in exchange to a secure place, their wallet. So they're going to be holding for a pretty good amount of time. Not going to be selling anytime soon, it looks like. So this is great news for Bitcoin. Now moving to our fourth story of the day. This comes from Cointelegraph. It goes, Voyager Digital will be crypto brokerage partner for Dallas Mavericks. So with this story. Voyager will use this as a point of accessing new customers or a new customer base. So this is also great news for adoption because it means there's potential to bring new people into crypto via the sales that they'll do uh, and the crypto that they'll use with uh, transactions going forward with Dallas Mavericks. Now to move to our fifth story for the day, uh, keeping it going. So this one comes from News BTC. Time to cash in. She soars 40% and snatches Doe's position in top 10. So to be brief, the people have through social media, in my opinion, my opinion alone, have hyped, for better choice of words, the Sheeb coin and moved its price upward via just talk social media. So any way you look at it, this is great for Sheeb holders because the value is increasing. And the more people that come in and, and grab hold of Sheeb, the more growth in, in the value of Sheeb we're going to see going forward. So great news, Sheeb. And our number seven story being brought to us via Michael McSweeney. It goes, El Salvador announces purchase of 420 Bitcoin worth nearly 25 million. So, as we expected, Bukele is Bitcoin hungry and is determined to make his country rich. So thank you, Bukele, for doing your part in raising the total market cap for us all that are in this crypto space. Thank you, Bukele, and I hope more follow exactly what Bukele is doing for his country with their own. Great news. Thank you. Our next story is brought to us by Nam Seos, and it goes, Bit Farms building two new Bitcoin mining farms of 78 megawatt capacity in Canada. Now, this is just overall great news. It means more Bitcoin as well as money to come into the market, as well as businesses producing the tools and materials needed to set all this up. 
So this is great for the economy as a whole and great for those that are in the crypto space. We're, we're definitely going to see a lot of good things happening as more companies get in this space because yes, that will be more money coming into space and it will move around in all directions. So great news coming out of Canada with the building of the two Bitcoin farms. And our final story of the day and the best story. And this was brought to us by Cointelegraph. And it goes, someone bought $3,400 worth of SHIB last August. It's now worth $1.55 billion. So let's talk about this one. You all have this same opportunity. This is a new economy being built right in front of you. As an early participator, you will, with patience, arrive at the same place, which is financial freedom. This is the great wealth transfer. This is becoming more common. Don't wait around saying, oh, Tomorrow I'm going to do it. Next week I'm going to do it. Don't wait. This guy made that move in last year, August of last year. And today, from that move he made, he's over $1.55 billion. So, awesome news. Don't waste time. Let's make it happen. All right. That's our news for today. Hope you enjoyed it. I'd appreciate it if you like and subscribe and come back and join us next time. Thank you for watching.